Range Rover Evoque 2020. The first model of this original car went on sale in 2011. After seven years, Land Rover finally decided to update the crossover. The second generation didn't change much, only some details were different. Nevertheless, the Range Rover Evoque 2020 is essentially a new car. The body was completely reworked, its rigidity increased by 13%. The car can be equipped with a 150 or 190 horsepower diesel engine, or a 200, 249 or 300 horsepower gasoline engine. Volvo XC60 2018 Despite the fact that this compact first-generation crossover entered production in 2008, it remained popular among car enthusiasts until 2017. After this commercial success, it's not surprising that the company decided to improve the model and keep selling it. The video shows the crash test of the 2018 Volvo XC60, each detail of which is designed to provide comfort and safety. It was such a meticulous work that, in the end, the second-generation Volvo XC60 was considered the safest car in 2017. It was able to get an almost ideal score of 98% in the category of protection for the driver and adult passengers, and 95% in the category auxiliary security systems. This is about 20% higher than its closest competitor. The vehicles equipped with new technologies to help the driver and protect absolutely all road users. The car has a system of autonomous emergency braking to protect pedestrians, a system to keep the car on the road lane, ensuring safety in urban environments and during long-distance trips. The BMW X5 2019 the third generation of this mid-size crossover entered the market in 2013. Traditionally, the manufacturer offered the car with the M Sport package, giving it a sporty and dynamic look. For the new fourth generation BMW X5 2019, the manufacturer has implemented a fundamentally new idea. The novelty is offered with the X-Line off-road package. This means that the car can be equipped with compact bumpers and patches with a protective edge on the sill. The package includes plastic protection of the edges of the wheel arches and enhanced protection of the bottom of the engine compartment below. In addition, there are several special modes in the driving electronics which are sharpened specifically for off-road driving. In general, the BMW X5 2019 is the first car in the series which can be safely used outside the city. Other notable features of the car include an increased size compared with its predecessor. A wide selection of wheels from 18 to 22 inches. Under the hood, you can install a 265 or 400 horsepower diesel engine or a 340 or 462 horsepower petrol engine. The Mazda 6 2019 The new car model of the Japanese automaker Mazda has many advantages that distinguish it from its predecessor. It's a powerful and stylish sedan, which at the same time provides the driver and the passengers with a high level of comfort and, of course, safety. During the crash tests, some key characteristics of the car were checked. For example, the vectoring control technology responsible for the directional movement when you have to ride in difficult conditions on slippery or wet roads. The intelligent assistant will notify you if the car has left its lane partially or completely. The 2019 Mazda 6 not only provides smooth braking when driving in the city, but is also able to estimate the distance from the vehicle in front of you 
and automatically brake to eliminate the possibility of a collision. BSM technology monitors blind spots. The driver will be warned about approaching vehicles from the side or when a car makes an unexpected maneuver nearby. Interestingly, the manufacturer supplied the car with a system of information about the driver's condition, which will notify him of his fatigue level when driving at a speed of over 65 km per hour. Audi Q8 2019 Here is a hybrid coupe-like crossover. It isn't a coupe nor a crossover, and it has a rather exotic appearance to please as many motorists as possible. The Audi Q8 2019 performs great in off-road conditions. Note the ground clearance height of 18.5 cm. The adaptive air suspension is able to raise the car for an additional 5 cm if necessary. The roof of the body is heavily inclined in the rear. The overhang is almost completely absent. However, the car has excellent stability and is pretty spacious. There are seven different driving modes too, and the car adjusts to the road conditions and the driver, changing the clearance, suspension settings, car handling, and much more. Of course, the Audi Q8 2019 isn't perfect for serious off-road driving, but as the test shows, the car can overcome small and simple obstacles easily. We want to highlight the comfort mode too, which will smooth out shocks and isolate the cabin from the noise outside, allowing the driver and passengers to travel comfortably. Kia Sorento 2019 it may seem that this mid-sized crossover is not the most suitable vehicle for driving on intensive off-road, on the mountains and rocky roads, but experts from the Korean company Kia Motors decided to create a car that wouldn't be afraid of obstacles. On the screen, you can see the new generation Kia Sorento in its standard version. The innovations added are all-weather tires and protection for the crankcase sump, while the connecting rods were removed. As you might guess, the car performed outstandingly. Any other mid-sized crossover simply couldn't overcome such a steep climb. The Kia Sorento went on sale for the first time in 2002, and the mass production of the new generation is planned in 2019. The range of engines at the Korean market includes three models, with a capacity of 186 to 240 horsepower and a volume of 2 to 2.2 liters. A notable feature is the new automatic transmission, thanks to which the car adapts to the driving style of the driver and the road. Ford Focus 2018 